This photo of my three nephews just says autumn to me. It's all three of them slurping down apple cider slushies. Hey there everyone, I'm Crunchy Scott for Crafting a Green World. So my nephews got those slushies when they went apple picking in Virginia, oh, about three or four years ago, and uh, my how time flies because they're all grown up now, but not too grown up where they can't hang out with Uncle Scooter this week during Thanksgiving and make some homemade apple cider slushies. The ingredients? Apple cider. Yep, that's all we're going to need. There are two super easy ways to make this. This first version is about as kid-friendly as it gets. Grab a baking dish, and it's really great if you can keep the baking dish in the freezer for a few hours beforehand. And I'm also making a small batch here. So for this part, it's gonna be about one cup of apple cider for every one to two kids. Then this goes back into the freezer. We're basically making a granita here, which if you want to eat it just like this, it's super delicious right here at this stage too. And I have a swap here, this one is already frozen, and with the granita what you want to do is you pour in your liquid, pop it in the freezer for about 30 minutes, and then you take it out and scrape it with a fork just like this. Then you repeat that process until you have lots of nice fluffy ice crystals. Super easy and perfect for the kids to do. But it's not the end of the world if you just want to let it freeze solid and then let the kids go at it with a fork. What I love about this method is that you can really control the amount of slushiness that you like. Just add some of the frozen cider to your glass and then fill it up with liquid cider until it's the uh, proper slushitude or whatever you want to call it. Kid approved slushiness. Look at that. Pretty nice. Mm, so good. It just reminds me of Thanksgiving. You can also freeze up some cider in ice cube trays Add those to a blender with a little more cider, and that's another easy breezy method. So you know how grown-ups have their signature Thanksgiving cocktails? Well, this is something really special you can serve the kiddos at your Thanksgiving meal too. It's easy, it's yummy, and it's all natural. Well, for more awesome recipes and eco-friendly crafting ideas, check out our website, follow us on Twitter, and like us on Facebook. I will post the links to all of those places down below. I'm Scott Meeks for Crafting a Green World. Have a very happy Thanksgiving. Mm. <clears throat>